Mark Ferrari, who's done so much, has such a long career, not just uh, being a rock star, being in bands, bands like, like Keel and his own band Ferrari and Cold Sweat, but just working in the music business and doing so much for artists and doing all kinds of different things. And he's also uh, in the documentary we did, Band vs. Brand, and you got to see that last night for the first time. It was an awesome uh, documentary. Uh, really uh, proud to be involved with it. Uh, I think it addresses an issue that's uh, super important these days, you know, as uh, as artists are selling less and less uh, physical product, we have to, we all have to figure out how to uh, keep those income streams, you know, healthy, and certainly branding a band is, uh, I, I can't think of a more important way to do that. Very interesting subject, it was something that had to be addressed that no one's really addressed before. They raised some really interesting points about bands from the 60s that no original members, yes. and yet they're still out there, you know, earning a living yeah. because the, ba the band has been branded in into the, uh, in you know, into the cultural mainstream. You've reinvented yourself uh, so, so, so much with, with, with your, when you're, 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 you're involved and came more involved in the business end from, from being a player. Well, uh, Frank Zappa said it best, he said uh, there's more business in music in the music business. And so I think all musicians really kind of have to know a little bit about the business that they're involved with. You know, look, if you were, if you were a, uh, a trucker, you'd have to know about the trucking industry. Right. If you were a baker, you'd have to know about the, bake, the baking industry. You, you've actually uh, been, been very, very, very good at uh, helping out struggling artists and well, educating them and making them understand. I wrote a book called Rockstar 101. And I encourage uh, all young musicians to go find that book. You can find it on Amazon. It's the first book of its kind actually written by a recording artist that deals with the business end of things. You know, how to put a team together, how to select a manager, what to look for in a publishing company, you know, what other team members you need to put together to, uh, you know, to complete that circle. Yeah, yeah. So you still play with Keel? Uh, I still play with Keel. When Keel plays, I play with them. Uh, I wish we played a little bit more than we uh, we are, but we are now uh, celebrating our 35-year anniversary here in 2019, and we have a couple things on the boards already. We're going to Europe uh, to play the Frontiers Festival in Italy in April. Uh, Ron put together a Keel Fest in. Uh, uh, Columbus, Ohio in May. Looking forward to that. Maybe there'll be a few more of those. Mark Ferrari himself got anything going on you want to tell the people about? Cold Sweat album just got released uh, after 28 years. Uh, just released on uh, New Century Me is in Century Media. Uh, so that's out now and we're actually booked on uh, we got we got a couple I can't say actually until they announced it but Cold Sweat you should be hearing more of the Cold Sweat uh, project pretty soon. Good one. Good to see you again Mr. Ferrari.